Yeah. Good morning, students. Today we are going to learn a new poem. Dad and the cat and the tree. Dad and the cat and the tree by Kir Wright. Kir Wright. K W R W R I G H T. Kir Wright. <coughs> Have you ever seen a cat climbing a tree? Yeah. Many times we see trees. Uh, you can see cat climbing a tree. Or even other creatures like dog and all, is it not? But sometimes it's a strange. Sometimes a cat may climb too high and get stuck in the tree. And sometimes it happens, a cat may climb too high and then it gets stuck, caught in the tree, unable to come down or get down. <coughs> the poor things can't come down without help. And then somebody has to give a help to the cat, and then it comes. Otherwise, the poor thing will remain in the tree itself. How would you help it? So, how are you going to help it? Surely, not like dad in the poem. Not like a dad in the poem. Okay. Let's see. Here is the poem which tells about the dad and the cat and the tree. Is dad a good climber? Now the big question. Is he a good climber or not? What were his plans? What were his plans? Did he get them achieve or successful? Read the poem to find it out. So, let us know. Was he a good climber? Was his plan successful to get the cat down? Let's see. <coughs> This morning, a cat got stuck in our tree. So, morning, what happened in our tree? There was a cat which was caught, okay, and unable to come out. Dad said, "Right, just leave it to me, okay. Don't bother or don't worry. I will take care of it and I will bring the cat down from the tree." The tree was wobbly. The tree was wobbly. A very big, huge, and in a different size or shape, which had no any proper structure. It was called as a wobbly. Okay, wobbly means unsteady. Unsteady. The tree was tall, and also the tree was tall. Mom said, "For goodness' sake, don't fall." And she was praying to the God. That the cat should not fall down and it should not die or get hurt or wound. For stop dad, a climber like me. Oh, let's see. Now she is telling to her husband, that is to the dad, don't fall. That fall, stop dad, a climber like me. I am a well-known climber. I can reach to the top of the tree. I will not fall. Guys, play this is. You wait and see. This is a small child's play. I will easily climb the tree and can get the cat down. You don't worry about it. He got out the ladder from the garden shed and then he brought a ladder from the garden shed. Okay, what we call ladder, mixon key. Okay, from the garden shed, it slipped. He landed in the flower bed and this is how while climbing the ladder, it slipped and he fall down in the. Lars bed. Okay. Never mind, said Dad, brushing the dirt. And he said, "Don't mind," and started to clean his clothes because he got dirt off his hair and his face. So even he made his hairstyle neat clean, and even his face and his trousers and his shirt, his pant and shirt. He tried to make it clean. Well, we will try Plan B. Stand out of the way. So now the father or the dad is going to plan for B and B. So he says, "Please stand out of the way." Mom says, "Don't fall again, okay?" Again, the mom says, "Please now again, don't fall, okay?" Then fall again. Said dad, "Funny joke. Do you think that I am going to fall again? It's a funny joke. It happened by mistake first time." Then he swung himself up on a branch. It broke. And then he slowly climbed the branch of the tree, and it broke, and he got stuck in the tree. He got stuck into the tree. Dad landed well off back on the deck. Oh, he fallen from the top. Okay, with a great heavy fall, with a heavy fall on his deck. On his deck means on his back, on a bump. Mom said, "Stop it! You will break your neck." Then mom said again, "Please stop it. Now you may get your neck break neck." Okay. Rubbish said that. Now we will try Plan C. He said, "Rubbish, what you are talking about? Let me plan for C." Okay, now what is the Plan C? Let's see. Easy as winking, showing 
or acting winking means showing or acting to a climber like me a climber like me do you think that going to fall i will go i will try to catch the cat and bring it down then he climbed up high on the garden wall and then after he started to climb up on the garden wall guess what he didn't fall guess what what happened this time he did not fall but he stuck in the tree he stuck into the tree he gave a great leap and he landed flat and then after he did given a big jump leap means a jump and he landed flat flat means totally slept in the crook of the tree trunk right on the cat in the crook of the tree trunk and now who is in the tree trunk in the middle and right on the cat right on the cat he went to the cat and what happened the cat gave a yell the cat gave a sound what is that and sprang to the ground and it jumped on to the ground who the cat the cat did not get hurt it's a very active cat please as punch to be safe and sound and it pleased that don't try and punch to be safe and sound nothing happened it was very strong enough as if a punch given it jumped like a ball on the earth nothing happened and started to run and safe and sound it was safe and started to make sound meow meow so nothing happened with the cat simply what happened the dad is trying all the plans a b c failed now he stuck into the tree let's see so it's smiling and smirking now what happened it is smiling giving a sound meow meow and smirking smirking acting okay smug as can be pleased showing very pleasingly showing and running away from there but poor old dad still stuck up the tree and now who is stuck into the tree the poor old dad stuck into the tree this is how you can see the cat left the place and went away but the dad who was thinking that it is a small work for me like a child and i will bring the cat down fallen twice and then lastly stuck into the tree this all happened with whom with the dad so it's a very funny poem is it not so let's know about the word meanings wobbly w o w b l y unsteady it is not unlevel okay it is not in a level then for goodness sake an exclamation expressing protest so please for god's sake don't fall again mom saying to whom to the dad scoffed laughed mockingly as if it is a very right hands it is a right hands work having over confidence mockingly making a laugh with a what teasing way <laughs> i will fall not possible then tries play very easy to do it's a very easy to do like a children i can climb the tree and i can bring the cat down landed well off fell heavily and he fallen very heavily on his back pleased as punch very pleased so easily the cat ran away down to the ground by jumping on the wall and from wall to the ground in the lawn and like a punching and like a ball bouncing okay nothing happened to it safe and sound unhurt without getting any hurt the cat went away for whom they were thinking the cat is caught into the tree the cat was not caught into the tree which and climb to the top can also get down easily but who is stuck and now the dad is stuck into the tree this is all about the comical or a funny poem the dad and the cat and the tree why was that sure he wouldn't fall he was having the confidence that much and became some poor confident due to ignorance which praise in the poem expresses that self confidence best he says that child's play it's a child's play by this we understand it is showing his self confidence describe plan a and its consequence so already plan a failed plan c was success what went wrong then it was successful but he struck into the tree and the cat came down easily the cat was very happy to be on the ground pick out the phrase used to express this idea now what is the phrase here it was yeah the phrase is pleased as punch to be safe and sound safe and sound is the phrase and describe the cat and dad situation in the beginning and at the end of the poem at the beginning it was considered that cat is stuck into the tree and unable to come down and in the end when the dad went to get the cat down 
he was stuck into the tree and the cat went easily rolling from the tree down to the lawn okay this is all about why and when did dad say each of the fallen fall never mind funny joke rubbish so these are all the conversations between the mom and the dad okay do you find the poem humorous yes it's a humorous and also funny read aloud lines which make you laugh okay many a times you see the dad falls that is the laughing part and even the dad gets stuck into the tree that is also a laughing part in a humorous city says that when the cat is stuck into the tree they want to help it that shows about the humorous is it not but in fact the cat is not caught in the tree now who is caught in the tree it is the dad so it is a funny comical and as well as humorous i hope all of you have understood this poem okay please go through the poem read the poem difficult words and try to write down the notes okay we'll see in the next class till then see you bye bye